my congressperson, uh, Lynn Woolsey, called me. That's what those last three videos were. And I had the microphone set too low. Something with this microphone either it's way super peaking in the red and you can hear everything or it's peaking like it's supposed to be and it sounds like eh, on a fucking airplane. So I apologize for that. As soon as I get my laptop back up, we'll go back to what we normally do. This is normally the setup I use for YouTube jail, but I'd have the laptop over to the other side. You know, now the cameras are messing up and like this, I got a bunch of technical difficulty shit going on. That's why you haven't got the regular dose of real AIX. You feel me? So, um, let me answer a few questions. The name real AIX. First of all, it was just plain AIX. Okay, uh, like seven to ten years ago, the studio I got robbed. And I was going through some troubles or whatever. And, you know, things went down. And the people who who did music with me in Broke Man Studios, Al Lane, uh, G Spot, Gerald Yancey, and Nate Nate Dog Brown, um, they used to all do music with me, and I was like pretty much the band director. So the night the studio got robbed, the only person showed up was Nate Dog, and I'm like, damn, I'm just extra. Motherfuckers just don't give a fuck. Niggas is scared, and I had that attitude back in the days. And niggas was scared. And I was like, man, I know exactly what this shit is. Let's go ride. Nobody would ride with me. So I'm like, Al is X. You know, and AIX had came to me in a dream before that. And I think I fell asleep watching the AIS commercial so much. And everywhere I looked the next day, I saw AIX. So after the house got robbed, thinking Broke Man Studio, all of us supposed to be tight and everything. The real AIX. Al is X, you know, um, and it was weird, um, so AIX stuck, but it came to me in a dream, and it was not, you know, me stealing the name from a bunch of people someplace in Australia, I think, it wasn't me stealing the name from nobody, and if anybody does Xbox Live, I'm the real AIX, I've been the real AIX on Xbox Live ever since I got the Xbox um, six months after it first came out so um those who question where I get the name from that's where I get the name the other day somebody asked me where that green light come from that was underneath me that actually was a fluorescent white bulb and for some reason the way this room is the way the light was popping in the room everything that the light was on looked green um, I'm explaining things Sean 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 I'm sorry about the pictures of the ribs they're on the other computer that's not really uploading ghetto gourmet is all on the other computer and it's not uploading um, when I get on YouTube with my laptop I turn it on I watch some videos whatever and as soon as I hit because you know I do all my quick capture stuff I hit the quick capture the computer freezes up the internet locks up so I go to Internet Explorer other than Firefox and it does the same thing either my computer has been hacked or uh, somebody downloaded some bullshit in my computer so what's gonna happen is I'm gonna redo my whole laptop and redoing the whole laptop I'm going to lose a lot of information I do have an external hard drive and when you transfer that shit over then you're wasting space because I can't just transfer all the files over because I might be transferring the infected files over and if I got the external hard drive I want that disease free you feel me you don't want no shit in your kitchen so um I was going to do a Chris Brown video today um, how he whooped the girl's ass because he got caught setting up a little freak freak later on so um so I kind of drama then she goes and says yeah he didn't beat her before so I TiVo the, the the original report from Harvey Levin and I was going to give my commentation um, I'm gonna be gone for a few days I'm sorry we got the birthday blowout extravaganza those who really seriously want to show up I think white chillin set the price at two hundred dollars you show up for two hundred dollars I'll feed you for two days we do videos we go to a few places um, I'll see if I can get the bar but I need to I need to have at least 15 20 people if I get 20 people 
I'm pretty sure they'll give me the whole bar. If I get 30 people, they'll give me the entire patio. And we don't know what kind of weather it'll be. But you got a week to let me know you're going to show up. And then you're going to have three days to send your money. And you pop up. I take care of you like I promised. My door is open for those who want to show up. RSVP if we don't get the numbers we don't get the numbers and ain't no party I'll still do something for you maybe I'll see if I can find out how YouTube uh, lets people do live broadcasts maybe um I'll let the big LD see if he want to put together something and then we'll do a, a show based on him and not me because like I said the music has turned me off right now because I can't master the technology at my hands because I don't have a freaking instruction manual and I don't have thirty dollars to go buy one okay what else should I say hmm this is pretty much a Lonzo report the Lonzo show so I'm gonna title this one the Lonzo show Lonzo tells all right shit like that so hmm they keep on kissing the flight um, the flight crew of the Hudson uh, River plane landings ass um, everywhere they go. A plane just crashed somewhere in New York and one of the 9-11 widows was on the plane. She was a very, very big activist. Um, hmm. I don't know. A plane crashing in New York, 50 people dying. Two weeks ago, a plane crashed. Come on, man. How come all this bad shit keep on happening in New, in New York? And, you know, uh, hmm. What can I say? Uh, Obama is giving away money again. Once again, these people are planning on giving the banks money, and the banks are not giving the money to the people. When will these stupid ass fucking people understand? If you have a business and your business goes under, it's like an oh well, but banks are institutions. If a bank goes under, fuck it. All the people don't have to pay that money no more that they owe the bank. The people who run the bank, they owe money to other people. They're going to behold the people responsibility for what the banks did. And that's fucked up. We're paying into these banks that are failing and they continue. What they're going to do is get a bunch of money and give a bunch of frivolous loans. Again, they're going to give a bunch of people frivolous loans knowing that, oh, we're going to drop... Uh, uh, 750 billion into the economy and it's going to create 400,000 jobs well if the state of California is going to drop off 20,000 people 20,000 state workers um, how in the fuck is that going to help because when you kick off state workers you fire 20,000 state workers right in a state that is already dying from unemployment then you're going to release 56,000 sex offenders and drug offenders into a market where these offenders need jobs in order to survive or go back to raping and stealing and getting doped out, stealing for dope. These people are going to need more than 400,000 jobs spread across the whole con continent. It's stupid. It's dumb. Give the people the money. Give honest working American citizens cash money to go find a bank because you think about it you give the people cash money they gotta go put the money in the bank then the bank gets the money from the people and not the government you're getting money from the government for the people and then the people have to qualify for it give the people the money they will run to the banks and give the banks the money even if the people stuck the money in the mattresses they still got to take that money out the mattress to go pay for their everyday needs. People would pay off their houses. People would pay off these fucked up loans that they got if the government gave them an infusion. We need a stimulus package and not the banks, not the infrastructure. The people, the people of America need the stimulus package. And that has been today's Lonzo Report. Pass it on. Keep on stepping on the electric wires in this motherfucker. Something gonna cut out. Romeo! Where you go? You trying to stay dry, buddy. I feel you. God damn, that was a long ass wait. Woo! Oh, now it's over. Bling.